Assalamu alaikum dear students we will start the new chapter introduction to trigonometry the trigonometry was first started by the indian mathematician aryabhatta in 706 ad this is the chapter number 8 in our book ncert for class 10th for class 10th now first of all i will give you the definition of the trigonometry the word trigonometry the word the word trigonometry is derived from three greek words three greek words tri means 3 gono means sides metron means measurement metron means measure the three the measurement of three sides of a triangle the major ment of three sides of a triangle or the relationship between the relationship between sides and angles of a triangle angles of a triangle dear students now first of all after giving the definition i will tell you the six trigonometric ratios now if we are taking the right angle triangle a b and c here b is the right angle and the side opposite to the right angle is known as hypotenuse this side is known as hypotenuse the side opposite this is known as the side opposite to right angle right angle and if we are taking here are two acute angles angle a and angle c if we are taking acute angle as a if we are taking acute angle a then the side which is opposite to the acute angle becomes perpendicular becomes perpendicular and the side which is adjacent adjacent to this acute angle is known as base साइड एडजेसेंट एक्यूट एंगल इज नोन एज बेस जो ये वाला साइड है ये एडजेसेंट किस एक्यूट एंगल के हैं तो ये बन जाएगा हमारा बेस क्योंकि जो ये हाइपोर है वो ऑलरेडी यहाँ पे डिसाइड हो जाता है अब ये भी हमारा एडजेसेंट साइड था लेकिन ये ऑलरेडी डिसाइडेड है दिस इज अ हाइपोर न्यूज नाउ इफ वी आर टेकिंग दिस एक्यूट एंगल ए देन वी हैव द परपेंडिकुलर बी सी एंड द बेस ए बी एंड द हाईपोर न्यूज ए सी नाउ we have the six trigonometric ratios first the first ratio is s i n e sin if we are taking the angle a then we say sin of angle a then we take sin of angle a what the sin of angle a side side opposite to side opposite to right angle side opposite to acute angle side opposite to acute angle a and side opposite to right angle side opposite to right angle here side opposite acute angle a is bc and side opposite to right angle side opposite to right angle is ac here bc is the perpendicular and ac is the hypotenuse so the sine of angle a simply uh, its abbreviation is sine we we'll, uh, we write sine a this is the abbreviation for the sine of angle a simply we say sine a is perpendicular by hypotenuse and to for so that if you will remember this you will call uh, 
परपेंडिकुलर बाय हाइपोटेनस सम पीपल हैव सम पीपल हैव लेटर ऑन आई विल टेल यू द मेथड हाउ यू विल रिमेंबर दिस रेशियोस दैट इज नोन एज सम पीपल हैव कर्ली सॉरी some people have curly black hair to present beauty later on i will tell you uh, this in detail firstly i will uh, teach you how we will find the these sex ratios second ratios are simply the ratios of the side uh, ratios of the sides of a right angle triangle two two sides ratio of the two sides of a right angle triangle after the sine of sine we have cosine C O S I N E cosine of if we are taking angle A then this angle A cosine of angle A curly black here curly black here side adjacent side adjacent to angle A by side opposite to right angle to right angle right angle that is side adjacent to acute angle a i have already uh, told you that this is the ab and side opposite to right angle is our ac here ab is the base and ac is the hypotenuse so we can say cosine of angle a it's abbreviated as cos a equal to base by hypotenuse base by hypotenuse so you have to remember this only sin a is equal to perpendicular by hypotenuse and cos a is equal to base by hypotenuse after this this uh, tan tangent we call it tangent third ratio is our tangent of angle a tangent of angle a that is side opposite to acute angle a by side adjacent to acute angle a angle a here side opposite to acute angle a side opposite to acute angle a is our bc and this is b and c and side adjacent to acute angle a that's our ab here bc is the perpendicular and ab is the base so we say now we say tan a is perpendicular by base these are the three man ratios now we have the reciprocal of these three ratios first we have the reciprocal of sin of angle a is equal to cosecant cosecant of angle a is the reciprocal of the sin a sin is abbreviated as sin sin a वो होता है परपेंडिकुलर बाय हाइपोटेनस एंड कोसिकेंट इज एब्रिवेटेड एज कोसेक ए इफ साइन ए इज परपेंडिकुलर बाय हाइपोटेनस देन द रेसिप्रोकल कोसेक ए इज हाइपोटेनस बाय परपेंडिकुलर एंड द सेकंड वन इज कोसाइन कोसाइन ऑफ एंगल ए हैज द रेसिप्रोकल सीकेंट सीकेंट ऑफ एंगल ए which is abbreviated as sec a which is abbreviated as sec a why we write sec a because we have the acute angle a we have the acute angle a if cosine of angle a is cosine it is abbreviation is cos cos a and the secant of angle a is the sec a the cos a is black base by hypotenuse now this becomes hypotenuse by base this is the reciprocal this is the reciprocal of sec is the reciprocal of cos and cos is the reciprocal of sec now you have to remember these ratios and the third one uh, tangent you have the tangent of angle a the reciprocal of tangent is cotangent tangent of angle a has the reciprocal cotangent of angle a this is abbreviated as tan a and this is abbreviated as cot a if tan a is perpendicular by base then we can say cot a is base by perpendicular simply the tan a is perpendicular by base and the cot a is base by perpendicular how you will remember this uh, this trigonometric six trigonometric ratio simply we 
we have as some people have some people have curly black hair to present beauty simply what we do we write the first letters of these words some i will write some uh, let me elaborate this some means sign people means perpendicular perpendicular here have means hypotenuse why you will find as you uh, you have to take that as a hypotenuse hypot hypotenuse and curly means cos black means base hair means hypotenuse simply why do you will find that you have to treat that as hypotenuse why do you will find the first letter as a p that is perpendicular and why do you will find the uh, first letter as b that you will take that base and t means tan t means tan present means perpendicular and beauty means base simply what we do we write the first letter of these words s p h c b h t p b what you have to do you just have to remember this some people have curly black hair to present beauty this means s means sign p means perpendicular h means hypotenuse c means cos b means base h means hypotenuse t means tan p means perpendicular and b means base so you will uh, say like this some people have curly black hair to present beauty sin is perpendicular by hypotenuse cos is base by hypotenuse and tan is perpendicular by hypotenuse now we have the reciprocal of these three ratios what you have read over above the reciprocal of sin is cosecant that is we write as cosec cosec means if this is perpendicular by hypotenuse you will write hypotenuse by perpendicular now the cos cos has a reciprocal sec if this is base by hypotenuse you will have hypotenuse by base and tan has the cot reciprocal if this is perpendicular by base you will write base by perpendicular got you for the next topic before going uh, to the next topic i request to you please subscribe and like my channel assalam alaikum